Hey, do you want to grab this flag, Captain? They were asking us to grab it, Cap. Come on, boys. Is that a woman? Hey. Oh, and they're dead. Why aren't you putting your Because when y'all said four gets. Friendly's charging him out. Hold your fire. On the star, 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 star. 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 Go get it, bro! Down the star. Press D. Down the star. Hey, 
Alright. Sir, my gun has missed my gun. Keep holding, man. Back to the rocks, man. Back to the rocks. Cover this tree. Come on. Yeah. 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 
We got some assholes right in front of us. Ow! Do do.
are. Where are they? Flag down, get that flag up. Flag. Up, flag. Up. Well back. from back here. Yeah, we're capping from back here. Get back in. Go back, go back, back to the back. Back, back. back to the left up the hill. Go back, go back, go back. Go back. Go back. Yeah. It's 
safe and I'm in formation, so. Oh, he's shot being on me. I'm getting the flag. Mm. I'm sleepy. Tell you what. Go to bed. I don't want. To. I'm sorry, bro. I want. To. Go to bed. Sleep now. Covered. Go to bed. Boom. Hey, yeah, you remember that? All right, I think we can uh, 
Game's too easy. Nice. First match rally on my voice. First match rally on First match rally on my voice. First match rally on my voice. First match rally on my voice. Scrum shot right here in these rocks. Independent oh, fire up the hill. The Rebel trash. rags northeast. Don't let them get that flag up. I think they're friendly. Oh, sorry. It, it, it might be. I don't know. Oh. No. no. That, that went better than that usually. No. Yeah, it does. No. What do you mean better than usual? Every charge we do is fucking fantastic. Yeah. It is all your best. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Contrary will be seen as an insurrectionist no. uh, bias the and will be dealt with accordingly. The other one is the first man. Away from the call out checks. Call out checks. Check. Check. Nine team falling to the left. Alabama, stay on the roof. Check. All right. We're even left. Let's move on. Oh, my strike. Double click. Double click. Double click. Double click. Double click. Double click. On the rocks, rocks gentlemen.
dodge it. Betrayal counterattack. Uh, okay. Get your reload, right there, bayonets. Right there, right there. Oh, get left side, left side. They're right yeah. there! Right there! Right there! Right there! I went through the door. Just stay on point, boys. Square, square, square. Oh, I'm just get behind you, fellas. Oh, I'm on the Durban. Oh, oh got it. 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 Maryland Heights had long overlooked the town of Harper's Ferry, which was once called one of the most stupendous scenes in nature by Thomas Jefferson as he traveled to Philadelphia in 1783. The town's namesake, the ambitious Robert Harper, had ensured that it became an important hub of travel and industry since its founding in 1761. During the Civil War, the Maryland Heights were quickly fortified with various artillery emplacements, Though in 1862, these defenses were put to little use by the sparse defenders sent by Colonel Dixon Miles, who commanded the Union garrison. After five hours of holding off two Confederate brigades with the mortal wounding of Colonel Eliakim Sherrill of the 126th New York, there was little holding the Green regiments together to defend the Heights. The Union troops would end up retreating to the town, leaving the Heights entirely to the Confederates. With the taking of the Maryland Heights, the next task for the rebels was for four Parrot guns to be brought up, each of which weighed almost 1,800 pounds and took 200 men each to lug them up the steep slopes of the mountain. The naval guns that had been set up earlier in the year along the heights, including the massive 50-pound Parrot and two 9-inch Dahlgrens, had all been spiked by the Union artillerymen when they saw the infantry retreating. General McClaws was then forced to focus his attention on General Franklin's Sixth Corps bearing down on the troops he had defending Crampton's Gap, leaving only a single regiment to hold the heights. They had much to thank from Colonel Miles' reticence that the Union garrison didn't attempt a breakout towards them, especially as the booms of cannon fire could be heard coming from the nearby South Mountain Passes on the 14th. 